Okay, you guys, do you wanna know where I am? You're not gonna believe it. I'm at the gym. I'm gonna go work out. You watched our vlog like two weeks ago, I think. I went in and canceled my gym membership. I wanna quit the gym. Which they wouldn't really let me cancel yet because I'm still in the contract. You wanna quit. So I have a little bit more time left on it where I can use it and that it's paid for. So I'm gonna go try it out and if I like it, I'm gonna stay in it. I wanna quit the gym. So I'm super nervous. I don't know, I've never taken a tour of this gym before so I really honestly don't even know what they have or where to go. And I forgot my earbuds. I charged my, I have really good wireless Beats earbuds and I charged them last night and I forgot to put them in my bag. So I don't have earbuds in my ears for music. They have music playing though, but still, it just makes me feel more private and isolated because I'm really nervous. But I brought my gym clothes with me. So I'm off of work. I brought my clothes with me. I'm gonna go work out. I'm just gonna do it. I just have to suck it up and do it. I'm tired of looking fat, feeling fat, having less energy. I want to be healthy and look good. And plus I like food and I want to be able to have treats sometimes. So I need to work out. But okay, I'm gonna go change. I'm gonna change in the backseat of my car because I don't even know what the locker rooms are like. I think I was supposed to bring like a combination lock and I don't have one. So I don't wanna take anything in with me except I'm gonna have to take, I'll take my phone and I'll take my car key. That's it. Anyway, I'm just gonna, seriously, I'm gonna change in the back seat. The windows are super tinted, you cannot see in this car. So I'm gonna go sit in the back and change. Well, it's super crowded back here and super hot back here. It's not easy when you're chubby. Now I am paranoid that people can see, but I really don't think they can. This is so not easy. Oh my gosh. Well, I can't change in the back seat anymore. It took over nine minutes. Okay, you guys, I literally have not gotten out of my car. It's been 30 minutes and I literally sat in my car. I watched a video about Planet Fitness and it totally freaked me out because I was going to do their 30 minute circuit thing, but I don't know how to use half the things. And I also just feel just totally out of shape. I don't know. And I don't have my earbuds and it's not an excuse. Like legitimately, it's not legitimately. It's not an excuse, but it just, I'm super anxious and that provides a level of comfort to me where I can turn on my phone, like watch YouTube or Netflix or listen to music and just have my earbuds in and tune everybody else out. So I'm leaving and I'm going to come back with my earbuds. I'm coming back tonight. First try was a fail. I'm coming back tonight. All right, you guys, I'm back. I literally could cry. I don't even know why I, I left the gym. I ran home. Kennedy brought out my earbuds. So I don't have an excuse now, but I'm like so scared. I don't know why. I'm not scared to work out. Like whatever. I can sweat. I can breathe heavy. I'm just scared of what people will think of me and I don't know what I'm doing and I don't know why this is so hard. Oh my gosh. But I'm going. I'm going to just do it. And then right next door is Sprouts and afterwards I'm going to go there and get a bunch of fruit and stuff. Okay. I'm just going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm just going to do it. I'm home. I worked out at the gym. I re-signed up for a gym membership. I want to quit the gym. It's okay, man. Be strong. It was actually mortifying. Mortifying. Horrifying, mortifying, whatever. I hated it. There was all a mix up with my account and I had to go out to my car two times so I walk I didn't want to walk into the gym one time I had to walk in three times to get my checkbook to get my debit card <sighs> it was just a mess and then I got in there and I didn't even know how to use the elliptical and I'm like pushing buttons and trying to figure it all out and I couldn't figure it out but I did it and then literally I think after like 30 seconds my thighs were already burning I think I lasted like 15 minutes I did the elliptical and I was like I'm done I'm done I'm done Oh, and Shad was texting me and like wanted me to meet me at the bank, meet him at the bank. And I'm like, oh, no, I can't meet you at the bank. 
I'm sweaty, I'm gross, and then I literally, I step off the treadmill, or the elliptical, and my legs felt like jello, and I was like, I'm gonna pass out in front of all these strangers, I just went out of here. I was really, like, actually wobbly. I. I just didn't like it, but at least I did it. And then Sprouts was right next door. So I went next door to Sprouts. I got a rotisserie chicken for dinner, and I got some strawberries. So those look really good. I got two packs of strawberries, and I got some grapes, and I got three peaches, and then I got some garlic bread. I stayed clear of the cupcakes and stuff, and I just got bread. And we're gonna have chicken and rice and bread. And here's my family. Hi. Shad got home at like nine o'clock last night, so yeah. you got home super early so today. I, and there's Keaton. And what, mommy. What? And and daddy and and daddy and daddy was at the door, and he said, Psst. "Really." Yeah, she she was um, she was in her room on the iPad, and I opened up the door and I went, Psst, and she jumped. She thought I was. What do you think? A snake. You thought I was a snake. Because <laughs> because he went this way. Psst. Do you have on lipstick? Yeah. <laughs> it's very pretty. But mommy, what? lipstick is really good on your tongue. It tastes good. <laughs> So the chicken from Sprouts, it's herb season natural chicken, no homo hormones, no steroids, humanely raised, and yeah, you can tell because it's the size of like a Cornish hen, but it smells delicious. I probably won't eat it, but it smells really good. All right, we got some rice cooking. It's just seriously long grain wild rice, rice aroni, like the easiest stuff ever. So this just needs to cook for like, I don't know, 20 minutes or something, and then dinner will pretty much be done. I'm wondering how I should make this bread. I don't know, should I like slice it up and butter it or just warm it up and then, maybe I'll just warm it up. And then we can dip it in like olive oil or butter. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Okay, dinner is done. Excellent chicken here. This is Shad's plate. I tried to get off the whole leg, but it didn't work. It no. fell apart. So, how is Sprouts chicken? Delicious. Yeah, better than Costco? Uh-huh. It's like $2 more than Costco and like a quarter of the size. Mm. But it's better for you than Costco's. I don't remember Costco's chicken, but it's pretty good. Good. And the rice, long grain wild rice, do you like it? Heavenly. Okay, dinner is done and it was really good, thanks to Sprouts and rice a -roni. And I am actually gonna go back to work, so I am leaving it up to this dude here to finish vlogging for the night. How many minutes do you need? Like three? Mm, no, 10. 10? That I can edit down to seven or so. How many takes? Can I do like 47 takes? I'd rather have 47 takes than like two really long videos that I have to go through. Let it run, we'll see. No, <laughs> that takes a long time. Okay, so time to clean the kitchen. All right, Keaton's gonna help me. Are you gonna help me clean the kitchen? <laughs>
How are you? Good. Good. All right, so Keaton helped me clean up the kitchen. Um, we sang the songs. We sang the songs. Yeah. yeah, we danced a little bit. We did that. We hung out, watched the football. And now we're winding down. Keaton brushed your teeth. And whining. And naughty. Yeah, you were a little naughty earlier. That's um, had to interrupt our coverage. Yeah, but now I'm going to be good. You've been good. I just want to ask you. Yeah, but you only like doing it with mommy. <gasps> and you. Okay, thanks. I, I like doing it with mommy and you. Yeah, it's fine. I, I like I, you. I like I like it doing with both. Okay, you're going to have to think, okay? Okay, but how old are you? How old do you think I am? 45. Yes. <laughs> good good guess. <laughs> How old is mommy? Forty. What? Really? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> what? How do you know these things? <laughs> wow, you're a good listener. How old do you think Keddy is? Um, six. A little bit off. That's okay. What about brother Josiah? One. He's, no, he's not <laughs> one. What makes Keaton happy? Going to Red Robin and... McDonald's and today you didn't get a happy meal today, did you? No. Okay, good. Where they going last night? <laughs> <laughs> what makes Keaton sad? Not going to Red Robin and Applebee's <laughs> and McDonald's and swimming lessons. <laughs> yeah, good answer. Where do we live? At here. At here? Where's here? Heaven. Ooh, that's a fun place to live. <laughs> Not yet, though. Where's your favorite place to go? To McDonald's and Red Robin and Applebee's <laughs> and, and, and to my swimming lessons. I knew you were going to say that. Can I...